Are you sick and tired of gambling your hard earned money on Madden packs? Look no further than my sponsor, MMO EXP, for the cheapest and most reliable muck coins on the market. And don't forget to use code FURDY at checkout for 5% off. What's going on, guys? Today we are looking at the brand new preseason team of the week champion, Emmanuel Wilson. And of course, make sure you stick around to the end of the video where I will fill out Emmanuel Wilson's final report. Uh, so here is the man himself, Emmanuel Wilson, 88 overall, of course, with him being a champion. But 85 speed, which, you know, Bo has 88. We have 87 speed guys. We have 88 speed guys. So dropping an 85 speed running back, that's the speed that day one Ramondre Stevenson has. That's the same speed that Kenneth Walker has. Just to compare to a couple guys, Jameer Gibbs, you know, guys like that. So, you know, this card speed wise is not that good, but he's kind of good everywhere else, to be honest. Uh, the acceleration is really good. He's 226. So that acceleration with a good weight, this card definitely will be pretty good in short yardage scenarios. I can almost guarantee that. Has a good break tackle. However, he's an elusive back. So he has a good build and things like that. Kind of has stats of a power back, but he's an elusive back with an 88 COD. Unfortunately, it doesn't get jukebox. That's going to kill this card, I think. I mean, it just is. It just it just is. No, no, no jukebox. You do need an 88 juke move. He does miss that. No, not even a spin cycle, not even an RB apprentice. So I think right now, if you're if you want a power back, it's Bettis. If you want, you know, someone that's not named Bo, who's an elusive back, it's Fred Taylor. Um, if you want RB Apprentice, it's Franco. And then if you want someone that can do all those things, it's Bo Jackson. Um, and then I think Emmanuel Wilson falls into that, into like the uh, Jameer Gibbs, like I said, Kenneth Walker, uh, even like Ramondre Stevenson category. Uh, but this card, I think he's going to play okay. I think he's going to animate well because of his size. Uh, but just the lack of jukebox hurts this card. That's one thing about him. So let's hop into the game plan. Let's see what Emmanuel Wilson can do today. I don't have the highest of hopes. The shout out of the day goes to my man, T t roy t t r r roy troy probably it's just his name a shout out to him for commenting the emoji on last video and if you want a chance we shout it out in the next one as we always do for packer player gameplays comment the cheese emoji for a chance we shout it out in the next one okay this dude has one of the most wild names i think i've seen uh, fat now slim seven two five three is the name like what i i mean i guess the dude the dude fell in love with the process man but let's hit him emmanuel wilson there's the build honestly a pretty good build he's got the you know the meaty legs there again he's 226 but we're gonna go to the swing pass oh i forgot swing pass is pretty delayed on the first time you try it bring that tackle and you see falling forward i put reach for it on him um but let's try like an up the middle run now i want to try to just get up the middle with him and see that acceleration work i want to see the weight work for us here um outside the numbers i mean like stretch runs it'll be hard for you to cut things back without jukebox but let's just try he's not using moving his user at all but let's see that acceleration that little pop in there we go that's what i mean like these animations on these heavier backs this year are really really nice i mean as long as you have weight you're going to animate pretty well in this game that's the thing i've kind of learned using some of these running backs weight is what triggers these fall forward and even like you know just just glitchy tackle battle animations things like that and also having that acceleration be able to hit the max speed that you're that you're trying to hit fast as possible is going to help you build that momentum and get further even forward further is what i'm trying to say um let's go back to the swing pass you know what, what am i doing here back to the swing pass but yes i am back in the spread playbook if you are wondering um it's about twenty thousand coins in the auction house but boy i mean it, it feels great to be back it, it does feel great to be back i didn't think i'd be back in it this year but um we are there's that little skip juke i mean the guy can still juke it's just jukebox takes your juke move to a whole nother level and if you've used jukeboxes here you know exactly what i'm talking about if you haven't i don't expect you to understand i, I don't it, it, it's it's magical it's majestic let's go right here we're gonna go i will go ace uh ace offset here uh no we'll go wings wait what am, I, what am i looking for i'm looking for this play right here and i'm looking for rpo alert bubble uh you know this run isn't the greatest on goal line what i'm kind of looking for mainly is just the rpo to rpo to cook if i see that corner across from reynolds take a step back or not match him it's gonna go to reynolds but let's see and yep you see right there it's easy oh the blocking is not as good in this one but as long as you have enough room and momentum where you can just bunny hop over, that's a touchdown every single time. It, it just is. It, it's a touchdown every single time. So there we go. And also, yeah, Emmanuel Wilson's got he's a good pass catcher too. Very good pass catcher. And of course, while we are on defense, this would be a fantastic time for you to head down below this video and hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. If you, oh my god, oh my god, if you play Madden 24 Ultimate Team and you're not subscribed, what are you doing? Gameplays, tier list, streams almost every single day right here on YouTube. Hit that subscribe button.
Uh, bro, that RG3 hit, I mean, not the RG3 hit, the uh, the Sean Taylor hit was one of my most satisfying instincts. I thought, I was hoping that would happen, and it did, and that should be a, a touchdown. That should be a touchdown. That should have, yep, that should have been a touchdown. I feel like a run or like a read option's coming here. I feel like he runs this ball, but we're shaded inside, looking out for the running back, and goes there, can I get a KO, there we go, all we need is a touchdown, hit that extra point, we walk out of here with a win. Let's get right back to feeding Emmanuel Wilson. Emmanuel Wilson. Emmanuel Wilson. Will, I don't think, will Emmanuel Wilson ever, like, is he going to, I guess if someone goes down there, but the Packers, I, I guess they're stacked at running back. I, I guess they are. I mean, I never, I didn't know this guy had a crazy preseason. To be honest, I really only followed, like, the Jets and, you know, the whole DTR stuff. He was, he was going crazy. But, uh, you know, I didn't know this guy was going crazy like that. And look at the second level. A little skip, little skip. Get it back, get it back. Okay, okay, get off me. Diff arm. And there's that weight, man. The acceleration is actually pretty nice on this card. The acceleration, I think, might put him a little bit above some of those guys I mentioned earlier in the video. Not Bettis or Franco or Fred Fred Taylor or Bo, but um, I think it does put him above. I, I like that 89 acceleration is really nice. You can definitely feel it as far as getting to top speed as fast as possible. And here we go, a little swing pass. And man, Spread has a swing pass in like every formation I use. So like, it, 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 it's nutty. It's nutty. You always, if you're playing me, you always got to have that in the back of the head that a swing pass is coming. And it could be a one play touchdown. It could be 15. It, 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 they're, they're, they're even better this year because the receivers actually block this year. It, they, they actually block the right way. It, it's crazy. And obviously, I'm still getting used to it. I'm, I added some new formations to it. I used to be very single dimensional last year. We're adding more to it, getting more used to it. Uh, and uh, hopefully eventually it'll be unstoppable and to wrap this thing up We have Emmanuel Wilson's final report and I'm gonna give him 13 stars 13 stars for Emmanuel Wilson I think might be the lowest I've given a player so far this year physical. It's gonna be three again I can pair whatever card I'm reviewing to who I believe is the best in the game and that's Bo and he's nowhere near Bo not only because of the physical and the speed but also because of the abilities. The lack of a jukebox or a bulldozer in his game definitely hurts him. So two-star for abilities. Stats are pretty solid and animations are pretty solid too. He honestly does have a pretty good build with good acceleration. So, you know, if you have a Packers team, that's probably the only way I'm going to touch this card, especially because he's not going to be that cheap. You know what I mean? So 13 stars for Emmanuel Wilson. Um, yeah, I don't know. How I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't like this card. I, I don't like him. I don't think he's a good option right now because, you know, you can probably get like, like look at a guy like the... Uh, campus hero uh kenneth walker he's just as good as this card he's just as good as him and he'll be a lot cheaper right now he's 200 almost 200k cheaper so yeah that that's the way i look at emmanuel wilson uh but it is what it is drop a comment down below and do you like emmanuel wilson and as always i'll see you boys in the next one